Okay, so I don't really know how to best do this, but ignore all the mess. I am selling the remnants of my mother's Lord of the Rings collection. I've already sold a good chunk of it here on the page. I just wanted to go ahead and make a video to kind of showcase what was in fact left after all of that. Um, I think somebody mentioned posting a YouTube video, but I'm doing it this way instead. So, uh, so this is the, I believe this is the Fellowship Binder. Yeah, so this is a Fellowship of the Ring binder, but it is not a fully complete set from everything I've seen, but I'm not sure. So my mom collected this uh, way back when each set came out, so everything is going to be uh, in here as it was from pack to, well, to page. Uh, it does include the Tengwar set. Uh, she organized it very interestingly, starting with, uh, <laughs> with dwarves. Uh, no idea why, but everything is still here. Again, I I can't attest to her sorting system. There that is. Um, I've given it a bit of a look through just to verify what's in here. There are no foils, so it's a base uh, set only. There are, uh, like you can see this R one here. It, I believe it is currently sleep. There is a sleep or something in here. Uh, hold on. Um, no? I don't know, it just looks like there's a sleeve in there. Oh, there is, it's just on the, it's like a backing sleeve, but that's all that's there. Um, but yeah, every card should be accounted for in the base set. I'm trying to do a more of a wide angle here, get you guys kind of see that the cards are all here. Now, she did have an issue where she taped the pages shut. I don't think it's impacting the cards themselves because I can still get a little bit of wiggle on the tops here, which is usually like my telltale. If I can, if I get in here and do a bit of a wiggle wiggle, the card still slides. So no issue there. They're just sealed up on top. So kind of considered a sealed collection in your own regard. Um, again, this money is, th this card set is being sold again for my mother. Um, I just, I had to take a bit of a breather from selling them all because I had a lot going on, still kind of do, um, but I'm just trying to get it all going. Uh, the base set from everything I've seen does not have the the One Ring Rare, uh, it's still the thing, does not have that, which is kind of upsetting because, you know, not in here, it's not a full set, um, but... I've also got a bit of fun with that for the uh, for the next. Again, don't understand her sorting system, but ends there. Sites are in their whole separate section, and uh, this must have just been from when she first started. So kind of like it's all there. And then there's a promo Balrog, cool. And she labeled Mines of Moria as the second set. So here we are for Mines of Moria. This set I believe is full and complete. I didn't actually look at this one. I looked more at the Fellowship. Got and go more. Oh, there's my stomach. I want my stomach to be in this shot. Uh, we'll kind of we'll, we'll stay zoomed in. We'll just kind of go page by page. Okay. So once again, no foils are listed here. Oh, there goes my tablet. All right, cool. Um, I will probably throw in a few of my own personal foils into the mix. I think I've got uh, some of the uh, Polish foils still looking around from Mines of Moria. I think I've also got a couple of Dwarven Axes from base set, just loafing somewhere. Uh, here's Realms of the Elf Lords. Yeah, it looks like, it looked like mine's was fully complete. I think Realms is also fully com Oh, that's a foil fireworks. I didn't even notice there's a foil fireworks in there. Cool. So there is a foil. Cool. Uh, one foil. Sure. Um, now I'm kind of trying to see if I can see any reflections of any foils that might be in here. I'm not seeing anything there. No, nothing there. Love that frying pan. Kind of wish it was an offhand weapon, but oh well. And then that is the, um, the fellowship block again. Missing the one ring unless you count the Tengwar, which, you know, we don't. Um, wait. It's not hidden behind it. Okay, good. It's not hidden behind it. Um, outside of that, the other binder that is still left over from my mother's collection. Oh, oh, grab it. Dang it. There we go. 
is her Two Towers binder. Now this is just the Two Towers base set with one missing card. Can you, uh, can you see my disappointment? It is, I, I can't stress this enough. I cannot believe that is actually the card that is missing, the common ring. I, I, I got nothing, but here we go. All that unused unlending that we all know and love. There's a hides right there. Now I'd like to note out that uh, in these, some of these don't get the, the tape treatment, but like every now and then you come across one that is taped. Um, I guess near the two towers, she kind of basically kind of gave up a bit. So, and I think whoever had purchased her, some of her collection last time had, might have seen that as well. So here's all that two towers joy. More of a Helm's Deep fan myself. Do love me some Warg Riders. Uh, all right. And once again, I'll, I, I uh, just to help kind of ease the sale here, I'll probably, like I said, toss in a few stuff, a few things that I have loafing around that I have bulk extras. Um, oh, let's get a page. Look at all those Uruks. Go in here. Sorry, this is a long video, guys. I tried to make this short, but these sets are rather big. I'm not seeing any foils. I don't believe there are any foils in. This collection again, just a main set collection. Price will be posted with the per with the sale post. Um, woo! Here we go. Look at all that. And then yep, there's the symbol. Be another very popular, useful card from the set. All your rabbit stew needs here. Uh, I think all the sites are here. Pretty sure they're all here. Again, I haven't opened this in a while. Yeah, it looks like it's all here. And it's just, again, no, no extra stuff. All the other sets, the end stuff, they all, those all sold. So the dividers are just kind of empty beyond that. All right, guys. Thanks for looking. Any questions, feel free to reach out. Thanks.